have good friends in both the Alliance and Fargus, so this fighting weighs heavily on me. I can't bear the thought of battling the Knights of Saros to the death. I have to keep my chin up though, right? Let's press on together, Professor. The last five years have been difficult at times. My relationship with Edelgard is rather contentious, due to the incident with my father. Nevertheless, I cannot abandon my family's duties. As Duke Iyer, I must play my part in the Imperial Army. Edelgard intends to abolish the nobility, but I know I can dissuade her from doing so. Hey, Professor. It's been a really long time, hasn't it? The last five years have been full of heartbreak. Not from girls, but friends and family becoming enemies. One of the things that kept me going was the hope you'd return. And now here you are. A lot has changed, but you're back. And it's the first time I can remember being happy in a while. I thought you might be at the monastery. That's why I made my way here. I decided to follow your path because I believed in you. But then you vanished. Now that you've returned, I have my guiding light once again. Welcome back, Professor. Ah, a new face. I am Randolph von Burglis. I'm the guardian of this place. Wait a moment. I'm sure I've seen you somewhere before. Ah, yes. You're Her Majesty's Professor. You're alive? Um, oh, this is my little sister, Fleisch. She's just a rookie, but she's helping me as my assistant. Uh, hello, I'm Fleisch von Burglis. It's nice to meet you. I know I'm inexperienced, but I'm gonna do my best. You can count on me to look after my big brother. I've heard you're planning to march into Alliance territory. I'll be here to guard the fort. My father used to be a knight in service of the royal family of Fargus. For a time, he was at the monastery. But apparently, he's back in Fargus serving as a knight again. Which means, if I fight with this army, I'll eventually have to face my own father. La, 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 la. Professor, oh my, it's so good to see you. These days, so many old friends seem to be disappearing. But you, you're here. It's incredible to see you again after five years. I have a feeling your name will go down in history. Greetings, Professor. Nothing to report. What's that? Do I have brothers in the church? You really are well informed. My older twin works for the Knights of Saros, but I think he's just a grunt. Not a noble gatekeeper like yours truly. Unlike me, he's very devout. He left the Empire a long time ago. I knew you were alive. I knew you could survive. And five years on, you arrive. We're reunited. I'm glad I kept watch for you in the downstream villages all that time. I was so devoted to finding you that I left the Knights of Seros. Now I serve no one other than you. I'll protect you, just as I promised Captain Gerald I would all those years ago. My adoptive father sent me here so our family name would be known. He doesn't care which side wins, the Empire or the Alliance. However, even if he tells me to come home, I intend to stay. I want to see this new world Edelgard dreams of. Professor, do you know how happy I was to hear you were still alive? I'll tell you how happy. For the past two days, I haven't had my morning or my afternoon naps. Yes? Allow me to brief you on the details of our situation. The Empire firmly controls the western portion of Fargus. However, the central and eastern regions continue to put up heavy resistance. The strongholds in these regions are Aryan Road, the fortress city, and Ferdiad, the kingdom capital. We cannot control Fargus until we have taken both of these cities. As for the Alliance, Houses Gloucester and Ordelia seem predisposed to capitulate to us. However, due to interference from Houses Regan and Goneril, we have yet to secure their cooperation. Claude obviously hopes to keep the Alliance whole through diplomacy. 
But because we have had to focus our efforts against the Church until now, our forces have yet to meet his. We have only recently begun to take the fight to Alliance territory. I have a request. Thank you so much. Professor, I'm sorry to have dragged you into the fight again so soon after our reunion, but you appeared at a most opportune time. I'm truly humbled by your support, my teacher. Thank you. And so I will. I'm hoping your abilities from five years prior are still intact. <laughs> Make sure you're ready to head out, okay? You've survived. How very fortunate. Were you dead, I wouldn't be able to fight you. But you are very much alive. Now I have a chance to kill you. For five years I fought for the Empire. I've cut down hordes of enemies. Now I have the same look in my eyes that the boar used to have in his. The look of a savage beast who loves nothing but destruction and violence. I hope not. You and Edelgard must not disappoint me. Mark my words. The future you're building had better be worth all this bloodshed. All right, I'm ready to fight. Let's do this. You're right. I gotta keep it under control or I'm gonna wear myself out too quickly. Maybe I'll just get rid of a few monsters. Or is that too risky right before a mission? Thank <laughs> you. 